Good day and welcome to the South African Lord. Okay, so today I'm talking about that newly seeded lawn of mine, which is about two and a half, uh, two and a half months old, and. Um, I've noticed that that needs a little bit of nutrients or food or whatever you want to call it and um, I've been fertilizing but today I'm going to top dress with this special mixture here um, so let's have a crack at it Okay, so I was away for two and a half weeks in Asia on holidays um, and while I was away some cold weather creep, uh, crept in and we had temperatures, evening temperatures of about uh, very close to zero degrees Celsius freezing point and um, that's turned my lawn, mm -hmm. I won't say dormant but definitely it's growing a lot slower um, you know where I was mowing probably every third or fourth day cutting off maybe about a half a centimeter five mils now it's hardly growing um, so today I'm going to top dress with my special mixture that I've got there I don't know if you can see that but anyways um, so I'm quite concerned not to cover the lawn um, or smother the lawn like you will do with Kukuyu or any of your warm season grasses so it's going to be a light dusting and um, just to feed this lawn and give it the nutrients that it's short of. Okay, so what I've got here is uh, one of my DIY projects. Um, so I've built myself a lawn level because I got quite jealous seeing a lot of people use this on YouTube. Um, so I decided to build myself one and um, I think it came out nice. But you know, welding is not one of my strengths, so I don't think I'm going to show you close-ups of how I mended the steel. And another thing I, I need to mention is, um, at first I thought I'll put in extra steel bars like I've done here to add some weight, but I think I may have I think I may have ruined it because it is so heavy I can barely pick it up. <laughs> okay, mind you, I'll show you some close-ups. Have a look at my welding work. I must say, I don't think I weld. I just put steel together using a method called welding. I don't really, I can call myself. I don't think I can call myself a welder. things I wouldn't do so here's the special mix I was talking about um, and the guy tells me every time what they put into this mixture and I cannot remember I feel so stupid but in any case it's something who knows they say it's brilliant okay so the method is pretty simple um, you know make heaps all over the intended top dressing area and spread it around and hopefully by doing this it will also level out the lawn a little bit because I've had those um, erosion sluits and whatever um, so hopefully that'll better that as well uh, because I suppose a lot of it's going to break down but the topsoil that they've added shouldn't <music> So before I go any further, I'm going to have a look 
whether piling it and dragging it around with a lawn level or a trusty flick method works best. Let's see. Okay, so this just happened and I had this sneaky idea it was going to happen because this thing was just far too heavy for a wooden broomstick like this. Um, so I'm going to try and spread it, we're losing daylight with a shovel. So the darkness caught me and um, I've just continued as you can see uh, to finish the rest of the lawn top dressing it. Um, now I'm just going to take my lawn level and drag it across here and see that I can get this top dressing soil to get down into the grass onto the actual soil and obviously to get it as flat as possible as well. The device actually works really nice. Really nice. I'm just going to show you a close up here. Okay, so I'm basically done. Um, I just want to show you how good this looks. Um, check this out. Okay, so I'm going to wrap up the video there. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, that's me top dressing this newly seeded lawn of mine, which is about two and a half months old. I think this lawn level works an absolute charm, apart from one or two things like it being too heavy and also maybe durability issues due to design flaws by an absolute idiot. Um, but other than that, I think it's great. 
Um, so hopefully this lawn will get the nutrients that it needs. Um, and it'll look great. It actually looked great before I did this, but I think this will even crack it up another notch. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the content. Uh, if you like the videos, please like and subscribe to the channel. And uh, there'll be tons of content to follow. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers for now. Bye-bye.